Hello Gemini, welcome to the Whistling Hermit channel. Today we are going to do an earth, air, fire and water tarot reading. Now this is a general reading so just take what resonates with you. At the same time it is a timeless reading so whenever you find this video that is the time that you are meant to see it. For our main energy, we have here the Eight of Cups. Okay. How come I have a feeling that some, for some of you right now, you are on a way to a journey? And because you're on a way to your journey, you fix all your affairs. You see here, all the cups are stacked. Well, well organized. All are stacked here. But it seems that one cup is missing. <laughs> Eight of Cups. No? Uh, I mean, if you are you stack them, one cup is missing. So maybe you're taking one cup with you. Okay. It can be that uh, you have chosen to commit yourself to somebody. For some of you, maybe you had several options to commit yourself to. But finally, you've decided one option. And you carried it with you as you walk away. So for some of you, it can be that for some of you, you have decided to settle down already. You had several choices before, but uh, you found one that you would like to spend the rest of your life with. Okay, so for some of you, yes, you have committed yourself. Maybe the possibility is that for some of you at this point in time, you have committed yourself to somebody. Somebody you are willing to spend the rest of your life with. And you have kept your affairs well. I mean you didn't have any hurt feelings with other people you made sure that uh you have you are in good relationship with the people that you have decided to leave behind so i may i think you made a good um sort of like you you said goodbye to all those who are concerned making sure that uh, i guess this is a sort of like a uh, a certain maturity on your part that you make sure that when you close a certain relationship or a certain affair you did it well making sure that nobody is hurt whatever it is so this is what i think now so i think you are walking away from other relationships and you have chosen a cup because one cup is missing maybe you have taken that cup and as you walk away you are taking it with you this is what is coming to my self right now in my main energy so it seems that you are committing yourself to one energy right now and you're walking away to the others which is quite good in a sense when it comes to a relationship if it is a romantic one it's good to have only one person that you it's it's going to be a washing machine if there are other parties involved okay now we have here the energies uh, the energy of the earth which symbolizes the things that are happening in your physical world the, en the energy of air, which symbolizes what is happening in your mind. The energy of the fire, which is happening with, with a, uh, which shows your relationship with the divine or with the universe. And finally, the element of water, which shows your relationships. Okay, so yeah. If we look at the element of your heart, you are really walking away from other relationships. I am not sure if there is a cup really because we cannot see him carrying a cup but for some of you maybe you have chosen a new relationship okay it can symbolize this lady here and this child so it can be a relationship with somebody who is already a child and you've decided to settle down uh, going away means sort of like beginning a new life okay for some of you now this is a little bit more specific already for some of you it's just that you can you have decided to walk away from relationships now whatever it is this new chapter that you're opening there are some anxieties here you see these swords that are in front of the boat as you start a new chapter in your life there are some anxieties which is normal i mean you don't know what expect what to expect but you are moving away so for some of you you are moving away from certain relationships for some of you Maybe you have not chosen any cup, but you have decided to concentrate on your career. So this is what is happening in your heart. What is happening in your heart is that you are detaching yourself already from other relationships and there is some anxiety behind it. 
you seem to be dedicating your attention to uh, a woman and a child okay uh, maybe a family maybe for some of you you are you already have a family in the past but there were some people who were disturbing the relationship and you decided no more I want to dedicate my attention to my family okay if that is the case then this swords is maybe the strain of uh, what has happened in the past uh, it's you know uh, the after effects of what has happened but you are walking you are leaving it behind and starting anew for some of you you do not it can be that you do not have any special person right now in your life but you decided to leave a chapter or close a chapter and you just concentrated in your career and you seem to be working well right now it seems that you are very productive you already created eight pentacles so in the physical realm i feel that you're as you leave relationships behind you seem to be concentrating in your career and because of that you seem to be uh, very successful right now uh, the, the it's already reaping benefits there now when it comes to to the mind you are somebody who has good boundaries and you depend you you all expect people to give love in return so you expect a relationship that is balanced just symbolized here by balance and justice so you you give what you feel you you give love at the same time you expect love to in return at the same time also you are very particular in uh, upholding what is right so somehow you are living a life of integrity maybe a certain conversion also for for some of you so in a certain sense for you you are upholding what you think is right and you expect also other people to uphold it you concentrate on your career you are walking away from a relationship there is a certain anxiety of leaving it behind maybe because you've got used to it so there is some pain in it some anxiety in it but still you are moving away now when it comes to your higher self when you try to see here your higher self is strong so i think whatever challenge you have right here i think you will be able to overcome it because we have here the card of the strength and your strength comes from a deep relationship with the divine you see here the eternity in your crown chakra and you are blooming right now the the productivity and the strength the inner strength that you have that allows you to face challenges in life is because of a deep relationship with the divine maybe that is the reason also why you uphold equality in with regards to relationship maybe you're moving away from a relationship that has not been balanced you feel that it's not helping you in your growth and your spiritual journey so you decided to walk away from it it can be and somehow at this moment your career is your source of consolation and also your attention right now and uh, it's benefiting right now because you are really putting your heart and soul into your work okay now let's try to finish with oracle cards now let us try to see what is the oracle card for you teaching and learning archangel zadkiel keep an open mind and learn new ideas then teach these ideas to others okay it can be related to this one this new idea this new inspiration that you have that you are working on later on what you have learned here you can share another thing that i'm thinking is your experience in this past relationship whatever you have learned from the school of life you can help others also who might undergo this challenge in the near future spiritual understanding archangel raziel i am bringing you esoteric information and symbols and helping you understand spiritual truths i feel yes now that you are leaving some toxic relationships you seem to be working on your career at the same time you're working in your spiritual life yeah i think so because here it's as if you are deepening in your relationship with the divine and it's giving you inner strength and you are blossoming right now so it seems that right now yes you are learning from the school of life and whatever you will learn from the school of life also from the divine or from the universe you can share with others in the near future well i hope this resonates with you uh um i hope also you will be able to resolve this one you are walking away uh, it might take some time there's still some anxieties but uh, there's a healing process there's a time for everything 
there's a time for grieving but there's also a time for healing okay so i hope this has helped you right now in your present journey and uh, if you feel this will help somebody don't hesitate to share it with them thank you for supporting my channel until next time may god continue to bless your ways